Let's get this show on the road! Once upon a time, many years ago, there was a long and terrible war. Quickly! 
sorry, sorry. I was dreaming about the war. The war? But that was a zillion years ago. Yeah, I know. Must be all this history I've been reading up on. Can't wait to get these exams out of the way. Oh, no! When the war finally ended, the people of the world made a solemn pact never to fight again. The world was divided into seven realms, and peace reigned for a thousand years. Hey! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Better late than never. So you guessed I was napping, eh? You know me too well. Honestly. How did I come to have such a lazy bones for a cousin? Cousin? You never told me you two were related. <laughs> for our sins. So, how did you two meet? Oh, we got talking one day at the academy. I'm Helix. Nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> Likewise. Wait, have we met someone before? Huh? So, how's everyone back home in Dumizia? Oh, uh, they're fine. No, I hate to say it. <laughs> You look like you're doing pretty well yourself. <laughs> Can't complain. Ah, almost forgot. Here, a little present from everyone. Oh. You've been in harbour for a year now. We thought you might be pining for a taste of home. You can say that again. This little beauty's going in a stew. By the way, how are you enjoying life here in the big city? Wicked war resume, a dragon shall the sun consume, and sibling souls be born as once before. But till the land be steeped in blood, may sovereign twins, however good, ne'er hope to rule in peace forevermore. Right? Isn't that how the prophecy goes? Yeah, not that I have a clue what it means. Maybe something like, don't you dare fight each other again! That's my best guess anyway. Will you stop waving that thing around? Oh, I see you're every bit as reckless as ever. And I see you're every bit as scared of a little fun. Me? Right, that's enough sightseeing for one day. Time to hit the barracks. Wh hey, wait! Wait for me! Not bad. It's even got a little backyard. Well, I say little. It was big enough to swing a sword in. Which reminds me, I never asked you how your studies have been going. You're top of the class, I suppose? Of course I am. I'm the best swordsman in the academy by miles. Oh, uh, is that so? Hmm. Here. <laughs> if you don't believe me, I'll be happy to show you. Quick spa while the pot boils? You're off. <laughs> I won't be holding back. I hope you're ready. Things are about to get serious. Let the jewel of the cousins commence! This is going to be amazing! Um, I mean, all right, recruits, listen up! Begin by showing me that you know the basic forms. This one first. That's it. Next, have a go at this one. Good. It seems your attacking is in order. Now for defence. As you know, enemy attacks can be evaded by dodging. Go ahead, show me how it's done. Self-respecting knight knows how to parry. If you please. A fine demonstration of offensive and defensive skills, soldier. Now, let's look at spells and special abilities. Remember, both cost magic points to use. Go ahead and try using 
one. I'm almost impressed. You've definitely improved since last year. I see that the old rivalry between you two is hotting up. Shall we finish by talking about tension? As I'm sure you have learned, both attacking and being attacked cause your tension to increase. The bar at the bottom left of the screen shows your current tension level. Now, let the spirit of cousinly competition flow free and fill that bar. A disgraceful display. Don't expect me to save your hide next slime recruit. Bad yourself. Very good. You two recruits certainly know one end of a sword from the other. Bravo, bravo! <laughs> <laughs> Must be stewed to perfection by now. Shall we dig in? Let's. Ah, smells just like home. <laughs> Here you go. Thanks very much. Well then, here's to a delicious reunion dinner. It's good to see you. And you. <laughs> huh? What was that? An explosion? What's going on? It's the Junisians! The Junisians are attacking! Huh? Did, did, he, did he just say Junisians? Yeah. Seven realms. We're not allowed to fight. And anyway, Harbor and Tunisia are supposed to be There's allies. There's no time to worry about that now. These people are in danger. Let's do what we were trained to do. <sighs> You're right. Me neither. We won't be very popular in Junisia after this. We can't afford to worry about that right now. Let's just concentrate on keeping the people of Harbour safe. Hey, do you think Cesar knows this is happening? Cesar? Who's Cesar? He's a prince of Dunisia. We're old friends. Kind of. I really hope he's not involved in any of this.
Fight's gone out of them. The Tunisians are faltering. And most of the townspeople have been evacuated to safety. We should fall back behind the gates ourselves. Yeah, that looks like the last of them. On someone your own size. <laughs> on your feet, you two. This is no time to be lying around. You want to save the harbor, don't you? Show this lump that bigger isn't always better. <sighs> Let's get started, shall we? Watch out, you two! They call these things nightclubbers for a reason! If that club hits you, it's night-night. It's... it's enormous! Since when did the Dunedian army start using these? Take a while to recover their footing after attacking. Wait for him to swing his club, then dive in and strike. Clear off. Hold on to your hat. Looks like he's worn himself out. Now's our chance. Attack! Be careful. Even if you avoid his attacks, the shock waves can still knock you off balance. You need to jump at just the right moment. Ha! Not so big and scary now, are you? I think he's just about had enough. Don't get cocky, you two. There's nothing more dangerous than a cornered beast. Bizarre, wasn't it? Yes, no doubt about it. If the prince himself was leading the attack, then something terrible must have happened. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Not bad at all. You two did well out there Thanks today. Thanks to you. If you hadn't stepped in when you did, well, we'd, I mean... Who are would you, you anyway? You're not from around these parts, that's for certain. Honestly, you can't just go asking who she is like that. You haven't even introduced yourself yet. <laughs> You're right. 
We haven't made our introductions, have we? But I fear that we'll have to wait. It looks like these gentlemen are keen to have a little word with us first. The full circumstances have yet to be established, but it has been confirmed beyond doubt that the Junisians were indeed behind this attack. The question of why, however, is... What does it matter why? We were attacked without warning or provocation. Firm and decisive retaliation is the only possible response. But, Your Majesty, to do so would be to abandon a thousand years of peace and risk the fulfillment of the prophecy. Mm. A thousand pardons, Your Majesty. Mm. If you'll forgive the intrusion, we bring the warriors who repelled the Dionysians, as per your command. Ah, so it was you who delivered the citizens of Harbour from peril. You have my heartfelt thanks. Ah, don't mention it, big man. All in a day's work for the likes of us. Seriously? That's the king you're talking to, you idiot. Oh. Hmm. And who exactly are you, might I ask? Oh, I'm just... sorry. Uh, I'm a student here in Harbour. I came from Denizia to study at the academy. And this is my cousin. She just got here from Denizia today. She's what come for a say? visit. You mean to tell us that Tunisian citizens were present in the capital prior to the assault? Of all. Admit it. You are agents of the enemy, what? sent here to lay the groundwork for this cowardly attack. That's not huh? true. We just heard a commotion and came running. We were only trying to help. Enough of your lies. Do you take us for fools? That's enough. Huh? Think a moment. Why would spies sent by Tunisia fight against their own army? It doesn't make sense. These are not spies. They are heroes. I will gladly vouch for them. And who are you, exactly? Forgive my rudeness. I am Desdemona, envoy of the High King of Accordia. Huh? I come at the behest of his radiance himself. <gasps> Your Majesty, my master, long may he reign, bade me make haste to harbour the moment Dunisian forces were observed crossing the border. My orders are simple. Do everything in my power to support you in preventing the ravages of war from blighting these lands again. Is that so? We Harbans have no desire to take up arms against Tunisia. We are more inclined to seek counsel with our former allies and find a means of restoring peace. These hostilities must not continue. Oh. To this end, we hereby call upon the aid of the High King. We humbly request that he act as intermediary between us and the people of Dunisio. Very good, Your Majesty. I will return to Accordia right away. Your words will greatly please his radiance. Wait! You have to let me come with you. I can't just stand by and do nothing while Dunisio and Harbour tear each other apart. Me neither. I'm coming too. Well, Your Majesty, do we have your blessing? <sighs> Mm. Very well, Lady Desdemona. Your two young friends may accompany you on your mission. Oh, thanks. <laughs> your Majesty, I solemnly swear we'll do everything in our oh, power to... Right! Now we're talking! Leave it to us, big man. We'll get the High King to help even if I have to twist his arm off. I too Shut shall up. accompany these brave warriors, Your Majesty. Please. Stop it! Huh? You should be serious for just one second. <laughs> <laughs> Go safely. Yes, yes, Your Majesty.
This is the final stretch of the road to Accordia. Not far now. I can't wait. I've always wanted to visit. Pinnacle of peace, here we come. So that's the famous tower. It's tall, all right. It'll probably take days to get all the way to the top. But seriously? You're planning on climbing it? Yeah! Huh? Huh? What is it? Something's coming this way. Huh? Through the trees. But you couldn't have come at a better time. But I'm in a queer old people, so I am. You're in a what now? Huh? <laughs> I see. Seems you've picked up some unwanted admirers. Well, uh, seems I have, right enough. Well, only one thing for it then. Let's give him the old brush off. Running into bandits out here on your own. And I thought I always had the look at them. They didn't always had luck on my side. You do. After all, you ran into us, didn't you? Sure, you're not wrong there, lad. I'm blessed to have found you when I did. All right, you're free to go safely on your way, good sir. By the jeepers, you've saved me bacon, so you have. How can I ever repay you? I wouldn't start celebrating just yet. Something tells me those bandits weren't alone. She's right. Look over there. Of all the cheap tricks, jumping out on people from bushes. Well, it's not all bad. Looks like they think we can't see where they're hiding. Exactly! Which gives us the element of surprise. I think I'm in trouble here. For the lover, how many of these villains are there? We're in a queer old pickle here, so we are. Oh, I wouldn't be so sure of that. Don't worry, we've got it all under control. Quickly now, we don't want to be overrun. Get them before they can jump out. Ugh, they just keep coming. Are you doing okay over there? Oh, don't worry about me. Save your breath. Sounds like you need it. It'll take more than this shower of amateurs to tire out the best swordsman in the academy. Yeah, and don't come back. That looks like the last of them. Sure, and I've not the words to thank you all. If I'd have been on me lonesome, I'd have been Benjax for certain. So tell us, Pickles, who are you anyway? What's all that rubbish on your back? But gotta forgive me, manners cultured as I am. Tornicoat to loons the name. Humble weapon merchant of Endertown. Yeah. Endor. 
That's not a place I've been to or heard of. I've never heard of it either. Mm, so you've never heard of it at all at all. I'm starting to think my little hunch might be right. I've only gone and wandered into another blessed world, too busy seeking out that legendary weapon to notice so I was. When you say another world, you mean this one, right? So the place that you're from is somewhere completely different, is it? Sure, it's the only explanation I can think of. I love a good old adventure, see, and there's not a patch of grass in the whole wide world I've not trodden me foot upon. And yet here I find myself in fields of an altogether unfamiliar green. I was rooting around for a way back home in yonder woods when your lads there took a shine to me. Simple as that, eh? You ran into them and they ran after you. Uh, Wait a minute, though. If you don't know how you ended up here in the first place, you probably don't know how to get back to your own world either, right? No. It's Tornico, correct? Uh, if I might make a suggestion, why not come with us to Accordia and see the High King? Huh? His radiance is one of the wisest men alive. Who knows? He may even be able to tell you how to get back to your world. And oh. besides, Accordia is where all the best and rarest goods in the world change hands. You might even find your legendary weapon there. <laughs> yeah, she's right. You're coming with us, Pickles. Indeed. Journey with us, good sir. You two. His name is not Pickles, it's Tornico. You can't just bully him into coming. He can decide for himself. Seriously, though. You should come with us. We can't just leave you stranded here. <laughs> oh, how's that for luck, eh? Hey? Landed square in the lap of the strongest, noblest, kindest band of heroes in this whole <laughs> new world. How could I possibly find it in me heart to refuse? I gladly tag it on with tears.
Now we're talking!
Welcome, child. Let us pray.